Hello and welcome to the show. We are here today on Beam NG Drive once again playing around with the flood and a race. However, this time around things are going to be a little bit different. You see, we are starting at the top of the crater and well the water level is here as you can see. Well, you can't actually see any of the crater, any of the map. We are going to be racing down the crater to the big suspension bridge thing that we finished the first ever race we did here. Now, the flood water is going to be receding. However, it is receding at a slower rate than our cars can drive. They are all around the 0.15 power to weight ratio. We're using this as a, as a rough uh, measure. But the water is at times going to be going quicker than we can go, at times going to go slower than we can go. So we've got to kind of judge our speed. There's going to be argy bargy on the way. There's definitely going to be pushing. Someone's getting pushed into the water uh, while we all try and deal with the water moving about, essentially. We can't run flat, like sort of flat out in this race. We're going to have to deal with the water, deal with other cars, get bunched up. You might be able to make up time if things go a little bit awry. We'll see what happens, really. Uh, I don't actually want to go too aggressive here to start with. Uh, oh, whoa. No, bad. I don't know who, who is it. I think it's Amy in that. God damn it. Lado tried to... Was it, I think it was, I'm going to blame Lado. I suspect it was Lado. Go on, Blazer. Amy deserves a spin. It's just a lot of... There's a lot of slow speed. Now, you might think the flood's going quite slow. It will. This will be diff a different story as we uh, progress. Brazen has been turned and is stuck on a tree. Me and Longbow are kind of playing it a little bit safe. Then the water kind of dissipates, and now there's this mad dash uh, when there's a little bit of time. And you might think, why don't you just hang back all the way? Well, if you hang back too far, well, yes, you can catch up to a degree. Uh, on the most part... Uh, because we don't really know how the speed's going to affect. You're not going to be able to time it perfectly uh, because the water, because of the rate the water's going down. So, yeah, you don't want to be too far back because you've got a lot of ground to make up later on. And it's really easy to mis make mistakes going downhill. This course is very quick downhill. Oh, I've locked everything up over that crest. There was a lot of panic and there's Lado in the way. Uh, hey, Lombo. Me and Lombo had nowhere to go to avoid a Lado. Oh, Joe's backwards. Oh. Brazen might have broken steering in all of this. Someone's lost a bumper. It does become a little bit more of a destruction derby uh, around. I think Shadow's nicked Brazen's bumper. Oh, Amy's fallen off. Amy's visiting. <laughs> well, <laughs> there, there, there. Yeah, that's, a, that's a soggy uh, burn site. That's the one. Uh, we are into the mud. Now, I do have all-wheel drive, actually, on mine, uh, which... I mean, will be helpful through here, although I guess Blazer probably will as well. The two 200 BXs are through and out the other side. I've shed my bumper. We are now going for more normal racing. Uh, oh, don't make a silly mistake down here. I can see the water. Blazer's really slowed it down. Shadow's gone for more speed, but it's going to have to get the braking point right. Oh, Himbega's locked and having an accident. Uh, Lado's going to catch up as we all wait for this water. And now, oh, Lado's going to get a great momentum through here. Oh, it's into the back of the truck. Blazer recovers it well. And now we can go back to picking up speed again as we climb up the hill here. Because, uh, yeah, as, as this road goes, you know, a little bit uphill in, in places, um, yeah, we get more of a gap to the water. Oh, where is that? It's so difficult to judge where that water is. Lado's going really quick. Lado's trying to right, wipe some cars out. Oh, Blaze is upside down. Lado has wiped some cars out. But of course, if you go ultra aggressive, you will damage your own car and your own steering. And I tried to sneak past Blazer. That was a little bit foolish. But yeah, you will wipe out your own steering and your own car. Blazers looks pretty poorly. That will put me back past. This bit of water, this bit of uh, track is... Oh, Longbow's caught up. Yeah, this bit of track, the water is going quite slowly again. Longbow is here. Oh, thank you. <laughs> we got a little help. Little help from Longbow there. Uh, right, mind the bumps through all of this. Oh, this bit here is super sketchy. We're on the water. No one has any brakes. Oh, no. I'm a hat. I am now not a hat. Longbow's hit a wall. Longbow's been spun around. Lado's flipped. We've almost flipped. In Pegas dumped Lado in the drink. Uh, I don't want to get involved in this. The I-Series is holding up. My engine's fine. Uh, 
Oh, well, I was going to try and drown Lado, and then Longbow wanted to drown me. That is such a silly race. Oh, oh, that's a hill. I'm getting out of the way before. Oh, that's a crunch. lado has got over a pothole, and Pega's visiting some trees. Okay, now we've got a little bit of a little bit of space. We can get some speed up. Uh, our radiator's still fine, which is actually really good news. Oh, I see the brake lights come on in front, and it's just instant. I don't know where that water is. Because Lado will see the water before I do. Uh, uh oh. Nope. <laughs> Sneaky kid. <laughs> We're around. It's fine. I'm back pointing the right way again. Uh, no, all is fine. All is fine. Uh, God, it has. I mean, the whole field is now clustered back up again. Oh, Impeg has been dumped into a tree, uh, or into the the ball into the mountainside. Impeg is. No, sorry, Lombo's pushing Lado. Uh, we were going to try and help, but couldn't. And at some point around here, the water is suddenly going to drop quite drastically. And then there's a bit of a race. Oh, Lado had a good shunt on. Oh no, my steering's broken. My steering's really bad. Uh, I might be out. Or might be out of contention unless Impega has a big crash. It's now become a demo derby uh, against Lado. Oh, we're around. Now this is going to be difficult. Uh, oh, no. Is my wheel? No, no, the wheel's completely gone. Wheel's gone. I've lost steering. I believe we are pretty much out of this. Impega's got a big lead. We've all crashed into one another and all been really slowed down. Can we make it to the finish line? I mean, my hope is... They might fall over each other. They might cause grief. Oh. Okay, handbrake it is. Handbrake it is. Lots of handbrake, lots of handbrake. No. <laughs> oh. That's a shame. It's just the tie rod. Honestly, if that wheel would fall off, I would be okay. We're not a million miles away from the finish line. But it might as well be in some regards. Uh, come on, I series. We're just hoping for... Oh, God. In the we Oh, no. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to leave it there. It's too annoying to drive, pretty much. Uh, right, so up ahead. Impega is still leading the way. Uh, then Blazer, Lado, and Longbow. They are all still running. The water is continuing to fall. The bridge is not too far away now. They are getting towards the finish line. Uh, however, there is some nasty surprises for you on this final straight that Impega is about to go and find out. And it's... Blazer and Co. are going to catch up. I think Longbow may have crashed. Maybe out. Uh, oh, Impega's found one of the nasty surprises. Yeah, there's some massive potholes down here. Not even potholes. I said, there's just huge trenches uh, for the cars to negotiate through. Blazer's crashed and is out. So it looks like, well, there is the bridge. There is the, fi the, fi the final, final run, the finish line. Impega is across the bridge. Impega takes victory in the 200 BX. Lado is going to cross the line in second place. It's a very silly race, this one. But Lado is across and finished. There we go. Yeah, Blazer has got moving again. But that's a wreck. And Longbow. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Longbow's in a pit. Longbow's not getting out of there. Uh, we put up a good fight. We, were, we we had a good a good run. We had a good fight. Shadow fell off on that at that point. But the broken steering uh, pretty much saw us out of a very silly race. We have the worst grid in the world for <laughs> round number two. Lato's facing the wrong way. Wonderful. Uh, yes, we've gone up in terms of speed. We are up to 0 0.2. Uh, it's slightly less significant in this, but the cars are faster, uh, so they should be able to... Well, they're going to carry more speed through dangerous sections. I mean, quite a few of us are in sporty cars. Uh, I mean, lado has got a Roma, uh, so bumps might be an issue for some of us. We're kind of going to see what happens. The ETKs... Well, me and Amy have ETK as a shadow, actually. We're slightly worried about the wheels. I've gone for the saloon because I've not actually driven uh, this one as of yet. But yeah, the wheels are the big concern. Bending them. We already had steering failure on our I-Series. Uh, so let's go see what happens. With this, I am going to just let them sort themselves out a little bit before we go and wander our way forward. Because someone's already gone swimming up there. Lado's going backwards and has almost... I, I could have maybe dumped Lado off the map, but oh, Lado! I don't I don't want to crash my car, because I'm genuinely worried about my car. 
um, about breaking some of the steering. And this first bit does become a, a sort of pseudo demo derby, as Lombard and Shadow might be stuck. They're trying to desperately drag their cars out from there. Uh, we are. Oh, I shouldn't have put my car into manual because I can't hear a damn thing. Just go back to sequential. There we go. Can't hear anything over the V8 roars of stuff. Uh, Lado's going to now turn around. Oh. I mean, it already looks pretty battered. That is a hell of a ravine to fall into. Oh, Impega's found a tree. Shadow's found an Impega, and Lado's found a shadow. Uh, I was being careful at that particular juncture, but I don't think we want to go too far back. We know we know that the leaders are going to get slowed down a little bit later on, and I know there's a hell of a drop coming up here. Uh, we need to be careful of. Does Shadow know about it? Nope. That's why we pulled the car across to the left at the last second. Oh, water! <laughs> it's a good protest of the brakes. Okay, that has held everyone up. Oh, we're going to sneak past Lado there. Uh, okay, ETK. Do not let us down. Brazen shot off into the lead. Oh, it's that that's noisy. It's the Grand Marshal that got a bit twitchy. That's very loud here. I want to get past it. I'm slightly worried because it will be quite tough. Oh, Joe's found a house. It's Joe's house this time around. <laughs> What's Brazen's house last time? This time it's Joe's house. Uh, I cannot get past the Grand Marshal on here. Even though I've probably got better traction. Uh, Grand Marshal has better tyres for this. We have better traction. But there was not really any room for an overtake. This is... I mean, this bit here could actually be very quick. If I trust my car on the bumps. I don't, funnily enough trust this car on the bumps. Brazen is stopped by the water. I am slightly concerned we might be about to get laddoed, which is why I'm going to put my car here, where it can't get laddoed. Uh, <laughs> I'm just I'm trying to have the car in best condition uh, for the end, because I know the vulnerability of this car. Uh, oh, that's a big hit for Shadow. Shadow may have lost steering in that. Got to be careful. Uh... Yeah, that looks very, very poorly. I've got to be careful of that spinning across the road. Lado's locked it up and spun. But Lado will survive that. Brazen's been turned around and is stuck a little bit. Can we poke our car oh, past the wiggly... Oh, God. Brakes, 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 brakes. Past the wiggly other ETK that's still in it. Uh, the Roma is there having a look. Oh, the Roma's gone for a <laughs> helping... Oh! Oh, I went to help. They're all off. They are all off. Brazen has taken out two cars. Uh, I did not realise there was a sudden pit to fall in down there. Oh, this is the slippery part, isn't it? This is really sketchy because your brakes just just lock and they stop working down here. Brazen's about to turn up at some, with some force. Oh, hot hole. No. No, no. Roll over. Roll over. Oh. Okay, we're fine. Yeah, sudden appearing potholes. Oh, hey, Shadow. My rear wheel's a bit poorly now. Uh, that's fine. Go in the water. <laughs> oh, the water fell quick enough. I think it comes down to three of us. Oh, <laughs> Brazen's found the pothole now. I've gone back into manual just instinctively. Oh, yeah. Neither me nor Shadow can really keep up with Brazen at pace now. I feel like our best bet might be the unsportsmanlike behaviour of trying to drown Brazen's car uh, or push Brazen's car off. No, oh, well, it was unsporting. That was not quite what I was going. I wasn't quite going for the tree. I was going to try and push Brazen forwards, but <laughs> we actually. Oh no! I've killed my own steering. I've been carbed and we're off. <laughs> well, our shadow's fallen off as well. I. <laughs> I mean, it, yeah, that's that's gone poorly. It's it's going to be Brazen that wins. Oh, Brazen's piled it into a tree. Does Brazen still work? I, I, if I hadn't tried to kill Brazen, we probably would have been... Well, we would have been knackered as well. It was going to be the battle of the broken... Has Longbow dragged their car out? Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> Longbow had. Oh, Longbow. <laughs> we were about to be excited. Oh, Brazen's fallen off as well. Uh, it's no winners this time on Takeshi's Castle. Brazen's in the drink. We're broken. Shadow's fallen off. Longbow could have won it had they not fallen off there. Oh, Lazo <laughs> and Blazer ended up. Where did they end up? I didn't even know that, that pit existed. Uh, Joe hit the house. Impega got unlucky. Impega ended up in the tree. Amy fell off quite early on. Oh, dearie me. <laughs> it was such a silly round. Oh, 
intentionally <laughs> yeah i agree sacrifice is the best way to sum it up but we are out oh what a race what a dumb dumb race it's second place for us but honestly we could have and should have done better but oh well up next we go faster again we are up to 0.3 in terms of the power to weight ratio however the vehicles are all on sport tires there is not a slick tire in sight here so there's a lot of power not a huge amount of grip not necessarily a great amount of braking uh, there's all sorts of vehicles some etks a bastion a van with no roof sure we've got a scintilla in here longbow's got a roma uh, i've gone for an sbr4 uh, I don't know. I, I'm hoping I might be a little bit stronger. The ballet of the incompetent is going to try to be avoided this time around, but there's no guarantee of the, what's going to happen here. Uh, we will fire off the line and head a little bit. Well, we, we will probably be a bit stronger than some of the cars here, but you don't want to get hit by the van, that's for sure. Uh, oh, I can hear a lot of turbo whistle, and I think that's from the scintilla or from Longbow's truck. Uh, yeah, let's just, let's not get involved with this. Lana's got a front-wheel drive touring car, which is a difficult choice to make work. Uh, oh, there's a little bit of bumping going on from, uh, from Longbow into that. We are now briefly released. Oh, God, over these crests. I'm gonna let them have their own fight. We've got Blazer behind. The Scintilla I'm not too scared of in some ways. Oh, big crash. That is, I think that's Amy out. Well, it might not be out of it. That car might well be able to reverse out of there because I don't think it hit that hard. Uh, it wasn't full racing speed hit, I don't think. A couple of cars have run off at the front. Joe and Longbow, I think, uh, have got out there. Me and Blazer are just kind of taking it a little bit easy. We know there's this big drop. Loads of cars end up in the house down here. Longbow has ended up in a tangle with Shadow. Oh! Oh! Hello! <laughs> Little bump like that, I mean, it's scary to be on the receiving end. Oh, go on then, noisy turbo. It's scary on the receiving end of that little bump, but it doesn't do too much to me. As long as it doesn't send me off the circuit, it doesn't really damage my car. That's kind of what we're trying to avoid as much as possible. Oh, we're going to go in here with some speed. Uh, that's fine. I'm kind of oh, happy a little bit to just sit behind these cars as long as no one gets stuck. Uh, oh, Lado's found. It's Lado's Rock again. Lado's Rock has claimed a Lado. Oh, it's going to get in the way slightly. It has got spun free. It has got stuck. Lado losing all that momentum is now stuck and buried in the mud. We are through with minimal problems. Longbow shedding bits of bodywork at me. That's not what I need. Uh, there's a bit of a gap. We lost time getting caught up with Lado's accident. Uh... I don't- I want to go quick, but I just don't know- I don't know how fast we can go down this road, because it's- it's steep. Whoa. Uh, shall we go for a pass? Lots of turbo noise coming from that Roma. Uh, there's some rocks coming up here that I want to avoid hitting too hard. We do. Yeah, I mean, Lombos just backed it off a little bit. Probably not the worst idea in the world. Uh, I mean, the floodwaters got quicker, so... We have more room to play with. I'm just going to go on the brakes here, yeah. Oh, I've locked it. In a weird place. Oh, oh, that's a ditch and a half. Yeah, I just locked the rears and it just wanted to go round on me. <laughs> it just it wanted to swap ends. But thankfully, that doesn't mean game over for us. we got lots of power. We know the floodwater is going to slow down here. Oh, no, 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 bumps. Okay, I should not have been pushing that. I don't even think I was pushing that hard. But, oh, bumps have flipped. Is that Brazen in trouble? Longbow has fully flipped. Longbow is uh, is a turtle at the moment. We've caught back up to the pack. Uh, Blazer is pushing uh, pushing in Pega, uh, who has subsequently pushed a Joe. There's steam coming out of Brazen's car in all of this. Uh, I don't know if we actually ended up giving the van a punt then or not. Uh, we're considering the hit we had. I'm not. At, oh god, I'm mostly not too bad handling until that happens. If it's old oh, Joe's found a tree, that might be the end of Joe. Uh, there, that looks quite broken. Okay, so it's in Pega and Blazer. Brazen. This is the, the similar names are quite difficult to uh, to, to uh, differentiate. Uh, don't know what's happened to Brazen. Haven't seen. Oh, oh. 
Ow. <laughs> Not that the back of my car can actually get too much more down. See, we can catch up as the water, but as a race goes now, that crash has done it. Oh, pot, hold, pot, hold, pot, hold, pot, hold. Longbow, I think, might have hit it in Pegas off. Impega has fallen. My steering, my handling is all over the shot. It's completely erratic. I don't know what's going to happen at any given moment. So we are hoping that Blazer has a silly accident, and I don't. Considering the damage on my car, I think that's going to be a forlorn hope, but we shall try. We know there's some nasty potholes coming up that could catch a car out. I don't think Blazer's got down this far, so might not quite be know where to and how to expect them. This is the bit that should be faster, but I can't go quick. My car is so horrible to drive that I cannot use any of the power. It was a silly mistake. I shouldn't have been pushing so hard because I knew the water was going to slow him down. I just didn't know how much. So we were gambling that we needed to push a little bit harder than I actually did. Uh, wow, well, it really picks up speed down here. But we're on the brakes. Oh, locked a little bit. That's fine. Another pothole to the inside. I mean, Longbow is there as well. We can't back off too much. We can't just kind of say, screw it, I'm going to play it safe to make it to the finish line, because Longbow will probably pass us. Longbow's not in great shape, but is in better shape than we are, I think. Uh, minding the rocks and everything. Go on, find some craters, find some potholes up here. Would be very, very helpful. Doesn't look like it's going to happen. Uh, we are... Oh, my steering is so difficult to get it turned. Oh, I think Longbow may have fallen off. Uh, and I tried, I tried, but we could not do it. The SBR4 is across the line. However, Blazer is victorious. The damage isn't great on my car, but it is enough to be horrible to drive. That, that's really difficult to drive. Yeah, I, mean, I pushed it as much as I could on that one. I think we pushed obviously hard enough, or Lombo's car might have been damaged enough that it was too difficult. Uh, oh, that's hit something quite hard at the front, hasn't it? So there, that was the end of uh, end of Longbow. We didn't see what happened to Brazo. I'm going to presume just fell off. We saw him peg his van fall off. Um, there is Brazen's car. I think steering failure might have killed that. Uh, Amy did get going again, but fell off. Shadow, we saw have an accident. Uh, Lado oh, did eventually get out of the mud, but that's a big impact there. The wheels actually flipped inside out. <laughs> yeah. Bloody hell. Well, no, I think I've been pushed off while I was, while I was flying around. It was a good race. It, I made it difficult for myself. I made it unnecessarily difficult uh, for <laughs> myself in that one. But it's a second and we do actually make the finish line at least. We head on to our final round. The performance has once again gone up. Apollo has opinions. We're at 0 0.35, which naturally means the noisiest bastion in the world is back. Uh, we have Lado transporting a pallet. Impeg is being brave. Uh, Amy has a mighty wing. <laughs> Shadow's lost all their doors. <laughs> Joe has also got the root of the Bastion. Longbow's got a scintilla that looks like a brand of actually really cool. And then we have a Mr. Turbo Cobbett uh, for Blazer. The water is back. I don't know what's going to happen here. I mean, I think the Bastion stands a good chance. It's all-wheel drive. It's quite heavy. It's going to be difficult to push. If I cannot have a silly accident, we should be quite good. It should be fast. In the later parts, I'm not going to go too quick, actually. Oh, uh, we have been rear-ended immediately by a scintilla. Not bloody hell. Brazen's car's worse than mine, I think, in the in the loud in the loud department. Uh, so yeah, we don't. We kind of have this like little bit of a stalemate. There's some pushing, <laughs> some pushing. Then we have a bit of a speedy bit. The final, the run to the finish line. We're unlikely to really catch the water. We might a little bit, but we are unlikely to catch it. And that. If I can be in the fight, we stand a pretty good chance with the Scintilla. We know, oh, Scintilla, with the Bastion. We know how fast this thing is on the run up the hill. Expect it to be similarly quick on the run down, but we've got to not make a mistake before then, basically. Uh, everything here is on slick tyres now. So we've got lots of grip, or relative speaking, lots of grip. Uh, lots of power. I mean, I've got lots of weight uh, in all of this. I'm just taking it a little bit easy. There's no point doing anything stupid at the moment. Um... I think Lado might have fallen off the course. Oh, brakes, 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 brakes. Amy is stricken across the road. Oh, I wouldn't reverse there. 
okay. I'm still fine. Uh, Blazer took two. I thought I'd broken a front wheel, but I'm not. The Bastion is strong. It has held up. Uh, yeah. So I didn't realize. I thought Amy was waiting for the cars to go past. Uh, they, they were not. And uh, yeah, silly accident was had. Okay, we are heading into the mud. We know we'll be okay through here. Oh, Joe has been punted into a rock by the... <laughs> By the hopper. I should point out, before we were going, we were joking about Impega having crashed Joe off in some of these. And we were laughing, that, well, what can the hopper do? But apparently, Impega has found a way to make life difficult for Joe. And that way was put their bastion into a rock. Now, I mean, I want to go, you want to go quick, of course, for a little bit. But you've got to be careful, because I don't really know where the potholes are. And we know, ultimately, we know there's some rocks coming up here that we definitely don't want to break our car on. We know ultimately we're going to slow down anyway. We know the point is coming where we're going to slow down. So I'm just trying to be a little careful. I've got race brakes because this the, the config I used on the climbs actually had standard brakes, which worked around here, which was fine. Aside from the fact that they got very... Well, they get very hot over long use. On the climb, they don't get too much use, but downhill, they will get a lot of use. So, yeah, we have got race brakes this time out. And a bull bar on the front for if we need to push. Although most of my front bumper has fallen off, so it's less useful. Looks like it might come down to me versus Brazen again. Brazen's having issues over the bumps. Oh, Brazen has got done a good job, actually, of stopping that. Now, if... Oh, that's not great. That's not great. Forgot about that pothole. We've all bunched back up. Amy's tried to drown in Pega. I was going to go try and drown Amy. Uh, <laughs> and steal the wing as Amy has a bigger wing than we do. Uh, Lombo, I don't know if they're still going. Uh, they might be. I can't see further. There might be some cars about to come and approach and join the uh, battle here. Uh, oh, brakes, 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 brakes. How fast, how, because the water goes a bit slow around here, doesn't it? And then it's going to be a mad dash to the finish line, pretty much. Uh, it's going to be, oh, there's been some accidents behind. Joe hates him, Pega. <laughs> oh, it was said beforehand, we thought it was unlikely that the Jeep was going to cause too many issues, but we were wrong. Uh, right, now I, th I think it might be close to a flat out race to the line here. Uh, it's going to be a case of who has... The, who knows the course better? None of us. Oh, well, I've got even louder now. My exhaust has come off. Uh, yeah, I don't think the water's going to play a factor anymore. My car is just deafeningly loud. That's a hell of a drop. Okay, where does this road go? I... Oh, I've got to be so careful uh, with this. Because, I mean, we really don't know this road, this part of the road very well. I'm all crossed up over that crest. And it goes, because it's downhill, it's so quick in these cars. Uh, carefully does it with the loudest bastion in the world. Uh, we will put the power down. I want to look back because I want to know how hard I need to push. The answer is still very hard. You can see the water. Yeah, the water's kind of mostly out of it. I am not stopping. My, my brakes are struggling. The ABS, so I don't, I kind of put ABS on this because the car's so heavy, I really don't want to be locking the brakes. Uh, but, oh, Brazen's right here. Uh, Brazen's going to go for a pass around the outside. There are rocks on the outside, though. You do not want to hit those. Uh, come on, Bastion. Now, we know there's potholes coming up here. Yeah. Oh, the back end's gone loose. Brazen's trying to send it. Brazen has, oh, got through. Yeah, Brazen found a gap and got the car through. I was, yeah, we were out of control at that point, and Brazen was a smidge. Bra Brazen's crashed it on the bridge, but Brazen will win. <laughs> Shadow crosses the line in third. We have to settle for second, unfortunately. Uh. <laughs> oh, but yeah. Brayson went for a gap across the dirt. That is so loud. My, thought my car was loud. Uh, yeah, Brayson went for a gap across the dirt. Absolutely fair play. I would have done the same. Um, I, yeah, and as the cars bounced around, we were the one that unfortunately came off worse. Out of all of that, Brayson came off the better of the two. 
Uh, yeah, and we will take a spin. That's unfortunate. It's a great race. It was a fantastic race. Uh, what did happen up here? Longbow has fallen off over there. Uh, that's had a hell of an accident. Amy ended up somewhere down there. Impega is in. Oh, Impega's in a ravine <laughs> over there. Uh, Joe, well, we saw Joe was, was in a rock, but uh, I guess in pushing to catch up has, ooh, had a big smash on that one. And Blazer has, ooh, <laughs> also had a very big smash in the cover. Uh, this is a very, very silly uh, game mode, a very silly variation, if you like on this. It's a lot of fun. Uh, it is just a sort of demo derby down a road. It's quite, it is quite an interesting tactical battle dealing with the water. Uh, you know, there's going to be contact. You're trying to keep your car alive and everything. Um, but there we go. That is going to be it for this video. I shall put a link to all the ones used in the description if you want to download them and have a go with them yourself. But uh, that's going to be it from me. Thank you all very much for watching. And until next time, uh, goodbye.